Wisconsin Huddle is brought to you by Ho-Chunk Gaming Madison. come in there and it's like there's not a whole lot to say like right we, we got beat in every phase of the game you know they out physicaled us they they outrushed us they you know it's just it, all those things and welcome into buck and honeys in monona i'm zach hanley he's jim ray dk and this is Wisconsin Huddle. Jim, thanks for coming back and joining us again no thanks for having me i'm glad i could glad i could get back yeah well the best word to describe Wisconsin's game against Iowa probably is ugly. 21 combined points, 18 combined punts. There was just no flow to it. And in the end, the Badgers had to watch the Hawkeyes take home the Heartland Trophy for the third time in four years, something they say was hard to swallow. We just got beat. Uh, we, we didn't play um, to our potential. Uh, we didn't play physical enough. But the next cue well enough, I mean, that's just what it comes down to. Um, I mean, at, at the end of the day, we just had to put the ball in the end zone once, um, and, and we win the game. It's just kind of sickening, honestly. That's how I feel. We knew that it was going to be hard fought, and they just out physical us. So I can't give you any explanation to why. It just, it just happened, and we just lost. Jim, a couple guys after the game said Iowa out physical you. How frustrating is that, knowing that's something that this program prides themselves on doing to others? Yeah, I mean, it's definitely frustrating. Um, you know, Iowa, give them, give them credit. They're, they're a very physical program. Um, you know, that's probably their identity as well. That's why, uh, you know, it's such a good rivalry. But, um, you know, there's just missed opportunities. And um, obviously, obviously when you, you know, lose a physicality battle, it's tough as well. Now, offensively, did it kind of feel like you were just stuck in the mud at some point? Yeah, I mean, I thought, you know, where those drives were able to move the ball and have success. Obviously, um, you know, field position battle was tough, too. Um, we're backed up a lot of times, but, um, you know, we definitely – had some things that we need to execute better on. Well, one of the bright spots for the Badgers was the play of Nathaniel Vakos. The sophomore kicker went two for two on field goals, including drilling a season-long 52-yarder that cut the Iowa lead to one in the third quarter. Lines are down. Here's the snap. Spot. Kick is away. Has the distance. Yes, sir. It's good. From 52 yards away, Nathaniel Vakos makes this a one-point game. And that's this week's play of the game so far this season. Vakos is perfect on PATs and 10 for 10 on or 10 for 11 on field goals. What's it like as an offense having a kicker that basically anywhere on the field he can drill it? I mean, it's great. Um, you know, being able to have, a, especially at the college level, a kicker like that. Um, the success he's had this season, the confidence he has when he steps up to take those kicks is truly special and uh, you know it definitely helps when you know that uh, anytime you get across the 50 you can put points on the board. Now it seems like every week he has a different type of celebration. <laughs> <laughs> this past week was you know flying like the Hawks I think. What are your thoughts on those? Uh, I mean I think they're a little bit silly and uh, you know but they have fun with it. Um, you know specials put in a bunch of work and uh, you know they, they earn the job to, to you know celebrate their wins, celebrate their victories. Um, so as long as he keeps making those kicks, he can do whatever celebration he wants. You're not going to do it? You're not going to join in? <laughs> nah, it's not for me, but I'll leave him, let, him in, let him in his zone. Okay. Well, now it's time for our quickie quiz sponsored by Quick Trip. Jim, you know the drill. If you get two of the three questions right, everybody's going home with Oof. a drink coupon. Since you're a receiver, we're going to test your knowledge of Wisconsin's all-time receiver greats. Are you ready? I, th I hope so. I'm a pretty big Badger fan, so. Okay, well... We're going to put that to the test. Number one, there are two Badgers tied for the top spot as the program's all-time career receptions leader. I just need one. Can you name one? Uh, Lee Evans, and I believe the other is Jared Everdaris. Okay, well, you got Jared Everdaris, oh. but Brandon Williams. Brandon Williams was? Yep. Oh, wow. Well, you got one. We only needed one, so that's correct. Was it for a season or? Oh, okay. Okay. In 2003, this Badger caught five touchdown passes against Michigan State. Who is he? That's Lee Evans. That is Lee Evans. Two for two. All right, let's shoot for perfection. Number three, as a junior in 2022, this Badger led the team in catches, <laughs> receiving yards, and receiving touchdowns. 
Who is this badger? That's myself. That's your red TK. <laughs> all right, three for three, which means we're all going home with a drink coupon from Quick Trip. And don't go anywhere. We've got more from Buck and Honey's in Monona after this. Salem Furniture's anniversary sale with up to 44% off store-wide and 44 months free financing. Plus, get tax included on purchases over $9.99. Huge selection in stock now at A1 Furniture. Madison's locally owned family furniture store. In a class three casino, you're playing against the house, so there's no guarantee a player has to win ever. And in a class two casino, the players play against each other and not the house. So someone always wins. So you're saying... He's saying if you want to win at something, you have to go to Ho-Chunk Gaming Madison, a class two casino where someone has to win. How about this then? Ho-Chunk Gaming Madison. This is Matt Gunderson. We recently celebrated the life of George, loved by many, feared by walleye. As part of his fishing theme celebration, everyone in attendance accepted one of his favorite lures. Allow us to personalize every detail of a life well lived. Are record energy costs putting a squeeze on your fixed or limited incomes? With inflation rising at record levels and incomes not keeping pace, you might be one of tens of thousands of Wisconsin residents who are struggling to survive in the blistering heat of summer or the bitter cold of winter. While you haven't asked for it, the Keep Wisconsin Warm Cool Fund and your local energy assistance providers are here to help. No Wisconsin resident should ever have to face the challenge of living without heat or power or face homelessness. For a hand up, apply today and call 1-800-506-5596 that's 800-506-5596. Or visit www.kwwf.org. The first warm weather team takes you beyond the barometer. Only on News 3 Now. Don't miss A1 Furniture's anniversary sale. Save up to 44% off name brand mattresses and get 44 months free financing. Plus, get tax included on purchases over $9.99. Huge selection in stock now at A1 Furniture. Madison's locally owned family furniture store. I'd say Hayden Rucci. I feel like I'd, I'd be I'd be bad at tight end. Yeah. <laughs> Chimere DK. He's got the athletic kind of fit tone that I like to have. I think playing receiver is definitely something that would be a lot of fun, you know, catching passes, scoring touchdowns. I'm an outside backer at heart. You know, I think I got a little finesse to me. Or I can play a little tight end, you know, knock a couple pounds off. You know, I, hey, I ain't going to lie, Kamoy got me excited to play safety. You know, a little bit of that. but. Uh, yeah, I'll say linebacker, really, linebacker. Nah, I'm gonna I'm 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 take Mooma's spot, because he get a lot of blitzes. Yeah, yeah, Will, Will, linebacker. Right. Ooh, I would love to be like an outside linebacker, so, uh, go against what I am, like rush the QB, I think that'd be so fun, instead of blocking for him, which is also fun, but I think rushing the QB would be really fun. So which, which teammate would you Oh yeah, I, I'd switch with DP. Dude's got mad twitch, dude's a monster, I'd switch with him. Oh, Terry Mordecai, 100%. <laughs> Definitely Terry Mordecai. Why? Because he has the ball in his hands. It's the ball in his hands, you know, he has uh, eyes on him all game. Not saying I want that, but it's pretty awesome. Yeah. Um, so he, he's, uh, he's the general, right? He's, he's the mastermind, and I think that's a pretty cool role to have. One. Not only did Wisconsin lose to Iowa on Saturday, but they also lost their starting quarterback. Tanner Mordecai is out indefinitely with a broken hand, his throwing hand. So now Luke Fickle hands over the keys to Phil Longo's offense to Braden Locke. And the freshman QB got his first taste of college football when he replaced Mordecai, throwing for 122 yards and an interception. It's a tough spot for Locke to be in, but the Badgers have full confidence that he can get the job done. There's nobody that's in this building more than, than him. Um, maybe Tanner would be the only other one that, that pushes the envelope to got to kick him out of here. Um, but I feel we feel really good about his ability to execute. I feel like Braden stepped up to the role we asked him to do and did a great job. And I think, you know, having a week this week to prep um, is definitely going to help him. And uh, he's a really talented player. All we got to do is give him time to make a play and he'll make it. Jim, what is it about Locke that gives you guys confidence that he can lead the offense going forward? 
Yeah, I think it's just seeing him on a day in, day out, you know, uh, basis. You know, obviously, um, you know, from a fan's perspective, uh, you know, they only have seen glimpses of him. Um, but the the way that he's he's competed in practice throughout spring ball, throughout fall camp, and into the season has been really good and showed a lot of signs that, um, you know, he's a really good quarterback. And, um, you know, I, I, the way he responded in the game as well. Um, you know, obviously we didn't come back and win the game or score as many points in the second half as we wanted to, but um, to have the wherewithal to step up in a spot like that uh, for a young quarterback um, kind of shows how much he cares and um, how much he's willing to work. And he can sling it, right? I mean, he's look at his high school numbers. Yeah. Uh, he's one of the best out of Texas. Yeah, I mean, I think he led uh, Texas all-time passing record um, in his division. So, um, you know, definitely a talented guy. And, uh, he can make all the throws that he needs to. So when he's not at the facility, what's his personality like? He's a laid back guy. Um, you know, he just likes to hang out. He goes golf a little bit too. I think that's, um, you know, something that's a big part of our team, especially in the summers. But, um, you know, Brain's a really nice kid. He likes to likes to dress and he's a big Lululemon guy. So, Lululemon? Huge. We're, every single day, all Lululemon. Okay. Well, we had a couple of your teammates test their knowledge of Braden Locke. Let's see how locked in on Locke they are. Favorite NFL quarterback? Uh, Lamar Jackson. I would guess Tom Brady. He feels like good because he's like an all-time great. Uh, my favorite NFL quarterback ever is Peyton Manning. I would say Naples 15. Uh, Naples 15. Uh, my favorite spot is Naples 15. He probably wouldn't do a sport. He'd probably do like modeling for like Lululemon. If I had to, to say. Oh. Lacrosse. I would play baseball in college. I'll go with Drake. Uh, Max Lamore. <laughs> I think Max Lamore. Ooh, my favorite music artist is Lil Wayne. Wisconsin Huddle is brought to you by Gruber Law Offices, Buck and Honeys, Iron Jock, Ellen Box Cheese, West Bend Mutual Insurance, and Team Lemmy NIL Experts. After a serious accident, you'll need a team to fight for the results you deserve. We're here for you whenever you need us. Gruber Law Offices. Proud partner of Wisconsin Athletics. One call, that's all. Enjoy Buck and Honeys before, during, or after the big game. Restaurants voted Best of Madison and celebrating Wisconsin hospitality in Sun Prairie, Monona, Wanakee, and new in Mount Horeb. Hey, Packers fans, how about celebrating the Packers season in a new 2023 Chevy Colorado Trail Boss? Hey, kick off your winning season with Quick Rewards Packers Points, only from Quick Trip. For every dollar you spend with Quick Rewards, you'll earn a Packers Point. Then, with your Quick Rewards app, spend points for your chance to win amazing prizes throughout the season. Your winning season starts at Quick Trip with Quick Rewards Packers Points. See quicktrip.com slash sweepstakes for details. Get 11% off everything in Menards. Update your bathroom with a Moen faucet that suits your style. Moen faucets give you a lifetime of beauty, reliability, and innovative features. Get this Finney bath faucet for $129.99 after rebate. Continue your renovation with Frontier Vinyl Plank Flooring. It's waterproof, durable, and easy to install. Featuring an attached pad underlayment for extra comfort and sound absorption. Frontier Vinyl Plank is $239 per square foot after 11% rebate. Save big money at Menards. After a serious accident, you'll need a team to fight for the results you deserve. We're here for you whenever you need us. Groover Law Offices, proud partner of Wisconsin Athletics. One call, that's all. 
Wisconsin looks to get back on track this weekend when they travel to Illinois to take on old friend Brett Bielema and the Fighting Illini. And that squad seems to be struggling to find some consistency. Illinois enters three and four with wins over Toledo, Florida Atlantic, and Maryland. On paper, this feels like a perfect get-right game for the Badgers, and it's one they can't wait to get back out on the field for. Came into our house and beat us, and um, that's something you definitely remember as a team and as a player. Uh, so this year, you know, really working this week to make sure we're ready to play, uh, doing the preparation necessary to go take it to them. Definitely one that I had circled. Um, just an embarrassment, I mean, in, in every way possible. Um, definitely, obviously, my worst game that, that I've been a part of um, individually. Joining us on set, Badger extra columnist Jim Polzine. Jim, a lot of storylines in this one. All the former Badgers now coaching there. What happened last year when these two met? And then, oh yeah, Braden Locke making his first start. Which storyline intrigues you the most? All intriguing, absolutely. Uh, it, for me, it's Locke. I mean, the quarterback is always a position that you lock in on, no pun intended. Uh, but for me, a guy making his first start on the road, it's a very fascinating story. I've had, you know, I heard Jim talking before, Braden's a great guy to talk to. Um, had some great conversations with him. He's a smart guy. I think he'll rise to the occasion. And Jim, what do you remember about your first start, and maybe what advice do you give Locke going into his first start? Uh, I remember my first start was at uh, Michigan in 2020, so um, you know I don't know if I could give the advice on the on the crowd noise or anything like that, but. Uh, you know, I think it's just trusting, trusting your training. Um, you know, all we do every single day is uh, prepare for moments like these, and um, you know, especially at the quarterback position, he's been preparing for this since he was a young kid. So, um, you know, if he wasn't supposed to be here, he wouldn't be here. And um, you know, every, everybody in the locker room has, has his back and has trust in him. And um, you know, I know he has trust in himself. So I'm excited to see him go out there and perform. Now, Jim, for Wisconsin to be successful on offense, what needs to happen? I think just limit the mistakes. I think we've been talking about that a little bit all season. Uh, First-time quarterback has to limit turnovers, but uh, offensive line has to limit false starts. A couple real killers on third down last year. Just play a focused game and, and try not to beat yourself, I think, is the, the very first key. Jim, you guys have won at Memorial Stadium five of the last six times you went there, including 24 nothing two years ago. Just what's it like going into somebody else's house and just having it quiet? I mean, it's great. Uh, it's probably one of the best things about, um, you know, college football. Um, obviously, playing at home is fun. You know, you get to be around your family and friends and, you know, all your fans that support you. Um, but when you can go in, in somewhere and kind of suck the air out of the building, uh, you know, that, that feels good as well. Jim, how do you see this one playing out? Yeah, I think, you know, you have to ride Braylon Allen, certainly the running game, uh, mixing some passes here and there. Uh, defense has been solid the last couple weeks, I think, improving. So, I, you know, I'd like to see them kind of keep trending in the right direction. I think if Wisconsin limits mistakes, they win this game. Like I said before, it's just cutting back on the stupid stuff, the silly stuff. Well, now's a good time to remind you to give us a follow on Facebook, Instagram, and X to stay up to date with all things Wisconsin Huddle. And be sure to check out our website, too, at wisconsin-huddle.com. Now we've got to take a quick break. More Wisconsin Huddle from Buck and Honey's in Monona after this. Hey, everybody. Jared from Stark on the Beltline. Proud sponsor of Wisconsin Huddle. We're small enough to give you great customer service, but big enough to help you find the pre-owned vehicle that fits your needs. Stark on the Beltline, Wisconsin's premier pre-owned dealership. At Bullet Health System, we believe it is important for you to know your specialist. Dr. Jamie France is a board-certified orthopedic surgeon dedicated to getting you back to living your life through leading-edge technology and world-class care with the least amount of downtime. Dr. France works here. He lives here. He is part of your community and enjoys family time on the ice, providing exceptional care to you. Know your specialist. Exceptional people, exceptional care. Cheers. Cheers. To your big promotion. Thanks. And to your new house. I know. What? I guess you had to move fast in this market. Right? Best thing I did was get a pre-approval from Summit. Once I knew my budget, I only looked at homes I could make a serious offer on. And how's construction going on your place? One month left. Must be stressful. Actually, no. I'm working with Summit, too, and they've been great about answering all my questions and guiding me along. It's been easy. Whether you're building or buying a home, Summit Credit Union is here to help. Hello, Wisconsin insurance brokers. Are you seeking outstanding dental coverage options? Momentum Insurance is your answer. 
a locally owned Madison company. We specialize in meeting Wisconsin residents' dental insurance needs. Our comprehensive coverages, competitive commissions, bonus programs, and online portals are what set us apart. Partner with us to elevate your group dental offerings. For details, visit our website at MomentumPlans.com. Momentum Insurance, your partner for outstanding dental coverage. You want to feel important, to be a part of something bigger, something that matters and can help change things. We know. We felt that way, too. And that's why we joined the Army National Guard. Take on your legacy. Visit NationalGuard.com to find out more. The Final Drive High School Football Coverage, Fridays at 10. We have a variety of quality pre-owned vehicles, including Hondas, Toyotas, Subarus, as well as many other popular brands, right here at Stark on Highway 19, located at 502 West Main Street, here in Marshall, Wisconsin's premier pre-owned dealership. Now, in life, if you want things done, you gotta go and do it yourself. Let's go, baby. Three, two, one. Six. And welcome to Wisconsin Huddle Unleashed. I'm Zach Hanley. He's Travis Beckham. And today we're going to play some golf pong. Have you ever played before? I have not. Right. I have not. Good, good. Maybe I have an advantage. But I like a challenge. Now, if you make this one right off the bat, when we're done. All right. But you're, you're an avid golfer, right? A scratch golfer? No, yeah, no, I hit the ball with a scratch. Like, man, where did that ball go? <laughs> so how often do you play golf, Travis? After my practice shots, never. Oh, come on. Come on, baby. How, how many times do you play a week or play in the summer? Uh, it depends on if my uh, my boss is watching this. Uh, because if he is, probably once. No, no, probably like once a month. Uh, if he's not watching, probably two times a week. I actually do need some help. Well, you can call a friend. Oh, yeah. All right, maybe we just back up. There it is, baby. Let's go. I think the, uh, the bucket moved a little bit. Oh, whoa, oh! I think he he might have hit to the Monona bucket, honeys on that one. In life, if you want things done, you gotta go and do it yourself. Let's go, baby. Wisconsin Huddle is brought to you by Gruber Law Offices, Buck and Honeys. Iron Jock, Helen Box Cheese, West Bend Mutual Insurance, and Team Lemmy NIL Experts. There is no off season. It's hard work day in and day out. It's pushing your limits, competing, and never ever giving up. College football is back, and I'm ready to have a special year. Lots of insurance companies make promises about how much you can save if you switch over to them. Well, here's our promise. With the West Bend policy, you can save everything. Every memory. Every detail. Everything you've worked so hard for. Once it comes time to actually make a claim, a cheap insurance policy can really cost you. Why not protect everything that matters with a policy from West Bend? Because the worst brings out our best. David Bakhtiari with an important message about your game day party. Now that it's football season, let's talk about something really important. Tailgating. I'm talking beers, brats, wings, nachos, and cheese. But not just any type of cheese. Ellen Box cheese. It's all good, baby. Do not forget your Ellen Box.
We often get asked, is it really free to hire Gruber Law Offices after an accident? The answer is very simple, yes. We don't get paid until we win your case. It costs you nothing up front to hire Gruber Law Offices. The call, the consultation, all free. You pay nothing until we win your case. It's just that simple. Call us today, Gruber Law Offices. One call, that's all. Say it's love. Braylon Allen making a change from DB to running back. The 17 year old has rushed for more than 1,200 yards this season. Sure, maybe it's love. But the more I sweat, the luckier I get. Saturday was a home game, which means Luke Fickle got to strut his stuff during the Arch March. And our favorite segment is back Are You Feeling the Fit? I like the blazer, I like the blazer a lot. I'm not a fan of the squares on the shirt. Plaid tie, nah, I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna give it a six, 6.5 out of 10. I do like the blazer a lot though. But he looks good, he looks good. I'm gonna give the fit an eight out of 10. It's got variety in color, it pops out and it looks pretty clean. So, you know, for a little lack of flamboyance, I'll leave those two points out, but definitely a clean fit. The black pants. <laughs> no, the, the tie, the tie, decent too though. I just, I'm not like, I'm not rocking with the jacket really, with this shirt. That's just me though. I've seen him do better. Uh, I'm gonna get this a nine because I made him mad at practice today, so I gotta, I gotta give him a nine for this, make him feel better about himself. So. Nine point five. Coach Fig, that's a ten. I love the jacket. I love the tie. I love the demeanor. I mean, this man means business. He's ready to rock. So, Jim, last week you gave him a 10 out of 10. I'm thinking maybe some of that had to do with you trying to suck up for getting a couple questions wrong on the quickie quiz a couple <laughs> weeks ago. But how would you rate this fit? I like it. Um, you know, I think it's a, it's a nice kind of classy look, but it also has a little bit, little bit of... Uh, a little bit of spice to a little bit of uh, you know taste and I like the red accent in, in the button um, the handkerchief so I guess I, I, I got to go with the 10 again a 10 um, you know he is a head man so it's, it's tough to go go against that um, I will say the pink suit he wore a couple weeks ago was a little questionable but uh, I definitely like this one Well, you probably still give that like a 9.5 right yeah somewhere in there <laughs> nine five nine six <laughs> okay well, and that's it for this week's Wisconsin Huddle. Be sure to join us next week at our live taping on Monday, October 23rd, right here at Buck and Honey's in Monona. Stop by the water for dinner and a show tailgate style. For Tim Ray DK, I'm Zach Hanley. We'll see you next week in Monona. Thanks for watching. Wisconsin Huddle was brought to you by Ho-Chunk Gaming Madison.